dawned on me the other day that I don't know if you've commented on Jacob Eason, who I guess you're able to since he is a uh, signed. Uh, I guess I am. Uh, what, we don't want to make too big a deal about anybody, but. Yeah. Um, what do you guys like about him? Well, we're glad that he's committed to Georgia. We think he's a fine player and a really fine person. And we're looking forward to getting him here uh, in January. And I hope that uh, I'm not breaking any rules. You got me. <laughs> he did sign that thing. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. He signed it. You're good. You want to talk about his actual like, no. skills as a quarterback and all that? Well, we, we, wouldn't be, we wouldn't have offered him if we didn't think he was really good. Sure. To see when he went like 14 for 14 or 15 for 15 or something, he had a perfect game the other day. What they I read something about that. Yeah. Good. Keep it up? You keep it up a little Keep bit? it going, man. <laughs> keep it going. What are your thoughts on the new practice facility being built this January and how it will help the program? Oh, I'm excited. I really am. It's going to be beautiful. Our indoor, our new indoor facility will not take a back seat to anybody's facility in the country. It's going to be a showcase for us and it's going to be also a uh, very uh, practical building for us to use for a lot of different reasons. I mean, most people think you use it when it's lightning outside or raining outside and that's it, but there's so many other functions for it that uh, we'll be able to use and it's going to be right where it belongs and it's going to be beautiful. It's, uh, it's really nice. How much does, how much does that um Make you guys have to think about the personnel you want on the field at a certain time on defense. Well, you have to. Uh, uh, you know, anytime you get a wildcat situation, regardless of what personnel grouping you're in, you got to have some kind of alert. You have to be aware that they're in it, and, and you got to call. Most most of the time, when they get in that set, um, most every defense in America is going to have a check for that. And we do too. Um, as far as the turnover margin, it's kind of picking up where last year was. It's plus three. How much of that is? I it was plus four. Maybe it was plus three last game. You're probably I right. don't know what it was. Yeah. Somebody said plus five and four, but I think, I mean, three. I think it's. I think it's plus. I think it's, I think we get, it's four. Did we get one? I thought we were plus one in game one. I, think you're plus, I thought you were plus three. Plus four. Right. And we were plus three. Is it plus four? Yes. It was. I think it's plus four now. Kickoff. That was. Fumble, so oh, they call that a fumble. Yeah. Okay. Well, that makes sense. So anyway. Oh, the onside kick good. is a fumble? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Team wow. Fumble. Team fumble. How much of that is just kind of, you know, cross your fingers? Mm -hmm. How much of that is yeah, kind of something you all sit around and, and oh, we, talk we about? We it. talk about it a lot. We coach it. We rep it uh, a lot. Um, and that's the ball security aspect of it and the, uh, and the ball disruption part of it. We actually have a period Every Tuesday and Wednesday called ball ball security ball disruption period. That's what we do during that time frame every day. And we usually do more than that, but it's a time set aside for everybody to get a piece of it. But quite frankly, we've had uh, offensively we've had the ball on the ground at least three times that I know of. We've gotten on each one of them, so that's that's been good. And uh, we've had some interceptions right in our hands that we didn't catch. You know that uh, we could have had even more of a distinct advantage in that ratio, but you know, we know that's, that's a huge stat for us and it is for everybody in America. We hope we hope it continues. Are you, uh, 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 I, I guess uh, if there was anything on defense, defensively you really need improvement in the last year was a, was run defense. What, it, it appears to be markedly improved so far, but it, you know, we're barely into this season. What yeah, do you see in there? Early. It's early yet. Um, I think we're sound fundamentally. I think we know what we're doing schematically. I think it's a matter of getting it done. But you're gonna we'll, we'll play certain teams that really run the ball well. That'll challenge us. And uh, I know South Carolina cares a lot about running the ball, and, and uh, so it, it'll be a challenge for us. Uh, every game, the goal is to win first down. Every every game, the goal is to stop the run and force them into situations where they have to throw the football. So that really doesn't change much. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.